Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. And today guys, we're not exactly at our normal spot. Now that's pretty much the garage. We're actually out here. I'm just pretty much getting some fresh air to talk to you guys about something that's been kind of bugging me. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. A lot of you guys have been commenting on my channel and you guys are telling me that, you know, why are you buying another BMW, which is a 335i. As I was saying, why did you buy the 335i? You can barely even afford a single BMW, yada, 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 this, this, and that. Guys, okay, first off, first off, I don't know how many times I need to say this, but as a YouTuber, my main priority, whether that's gonna bring me stress or not, is to bring you guys content. I love doing what I do, and part of that is spending a whole lot of money on BMWs, and that's what makes some of you guys happy, and that's what makes some of you guys really upset. I mean, I don't know why that really affects you. If you don't like seeing BMW content, then don't watch the channel, but a lot of you guys are not happy with the choices I've been making recently. You guys are like, why are you taking it down to the shop? I mean, this car looks like it's an absolute, you know, no-go, this, this, and that. People are telling me the car is gonna fully rust up, it's gonna be destroyed. People are telling me the fuel pump's gonna go out, you might as well just sell the car. I'm just like, are you guys, why are you all so negative? Like, the car is a build on the channel. This build is gonna be insane, guys. I'm telling you 100%, I'm not quitting on I'm not doing anything like that. Now you guys are saying, why are you talking about this now? Like, you're so far into the 335. I'm actually talking about this now because I posted something on my, Insta on my YouTube, actually, my YouTube community tab, saying, you know, hypothetically, if I was to buy another car tomorrow, how would you guys react? And I was, it was kind of like a, it was kind of to like test you guys and just see what, like, what page you guys and me are on. And it turns out we're honestly not on the same page here at all. Even my dad came up to me the other day. He's like, yo, Nora, I'm not I'm not really seeing the money from YouTube coming in. Like, how, how, how come like I'm always seeing your bank accounts pretty much like gone? And I'm just like, to be honest with you, it's going right back into the cars. And a lot of people might say, yo, that's very stupid. Why are you putting a lot of money into your cars? You guys don't realize that what I do my YouTube channel, it's not sitting in front of a camera all day talking about what school stuff you should wear to school or, you know, reacting to a music video. I, my, pretty much what I do on the YouTube platform is modify and repair pretty much BMWs or, or any sport car in that matter. My, what I do on this channel is not cheap. And what I do on this channel is not a video I could whip out in like two seconds, three minutes to go get a full-time job and go to college. Doing what I do, I need daylight. I need time. I need like a lot of time. Working on BMWs is not something you could just whip out. Like sometimes it takes, you know, six hours for some stupid little serpentine belt. Sometimes things just happen in cars, you know, they take time. Getting back to my comment about the other day about buying another car. Um, so I'm gonna address this in this video before I actually introduce the car or anything like that. And that's the fact that I actually bought another car. Now, I don't know if you guys would consider this a car or a parts car or a rebuild or whatever you guys wanna consider it. Me and my friend are online. I'll have his channel down below. Um, we, we pretty much tagged up to buy a really cheap car. And it's not because of financially tagged up to buy the car. We ended up getting one of the cheapest BMWs you guys will ever see. And I'll mention that, I'll make a title, I'll make, it, I'll make the video for it. We got an E90 for a price that you just can't pass up. Like when I mean like, I can't pass up, I mean like under a grand. And I mean under a grand, I mean far below a grand. So you guys will see the video on that soon. But yeah, I did end up getting another car and that's all I can say right now. That's all I can say. And for those of you guys who are gonna be all like, how are you just gonna quit on the 335? I'm not quitting on the 335. Why did I buy another car? for more content for you guys because my number one priority is growing my fan base, is growing my YouTube channel, is just growing. I, I like this community. I like having you guys to talk to. I don't know if you guys see all the time, I always mention about how literally my uploads, when I upload a video, the most enjoyable thing in the entire day, whether it's you know going out with family or whatever, I'm always on my phone reading comments. I just love interacting with you guys, and one of the one of the sacrifices I have to deal with is money. And unfortunately, I, I'm not able to spend as much money as my friends. I'm always spending on like Yeezys or some you know some really nice things, some really nice clothes and stuff. I can't spend that kind of money because that will pretty much take a lot of my paycheck that I'm gonna have to use toward this car. It's gonna take a lot out of my paycheck, and I need to use those paychecks to invest pretty much into the channel, buying BMWs and repairing BMWs and fixing BMWs is pretty much reinvesting into this channel because this is what this channel is about. So if, I don't know if you guys consider cars an investment, but for this channel, it kinda is. That's how my growth happens. The way you guys are reacting to the videos, I could tell that whenever there's a build, you guys love it, so that's what I'm gonna do. Now, I hope you guys understand. For those of you guys who still don't understand, honestly, I don't care. Just, just honestly, unsubscribe. I mean, I really hate the hate comments. I feel like you guys think that I could just 
build a car, you know, top to bottom, very expensive, just take it out to a shop, do everything professionally. That's not what this channel is about. I'm gonna hate the criticism that I'm getting. It's like, oh, you didn't do this right, you didn't do that right. Yo, if it works, it's called a budget build, you know? I'm a college student, I'm doing these budget builds for those of you guys who are trying to buy these cars on a budget, and I'm sick and tired of those of you guys are saying you should have done this professionally, should have spent the $2,000 on a paint job because that's what'll look nicer. You should have just got the 335i M Sport because you're making an M Sport. Why you? Why are you making an M Sport? Coming out of my perspective, I'd rather wrap a car because that's content. I'd rather do an M Sport conversion because that's content. Now, I don't want to keep ranting on, but what I'm doing, guys, just know I have a purpose. This channel is all about working on cars, making my hobby, and pretty much documenting it. I love repairing BMWs. I like working on BMWs. I like to pretty much do something different to every single BMW. Like, this is kind of one with an M3 style. The 335s an M Sport. I might pick up another car as a drift build. I just want to do all kinds of different things with E90s because that's currently what I love, and I might go down to, you know, the F chassis and stuff like that. And the 335i will be back to the channel soon again i didn't quit on it i would never quit on it that car is gonna be the most insane car on the channel I, if anything that's a car i'm gonna keep forever this car is actually gonna be going sometime in the near future so yeah once that uh, the 335 is back from the chop we'll continue videos on that it could be in a day could be in a week i don't know but i have another car to make content on and that's the whole purpose of this channel is to keep producing content and if that is for me to spend the every single penny to make you guys good content that's what i'm going to do because that's what i love to do and that's what you guys like to see and you know if that affects me you guys i love you guys for caring but this is what I want to do. And just know that's what I want to do. And as long as you guys support me, that's all I want from you guys. I love y'all so much. I'll see you guys in the next one. Could be the new car reveal or probably getting the 335i back from the shop. Regardless, it's going to be a good video. Peace out. She got me saying, yalla, huh, baby. I need you to see me. Quit with the front and then put your guard down, girl. We know you ain't easy. She got me saying, yalla, huh, baby. I need you to see me. Quit with the front and then put your guard down, girl. We know you ain't easy, you know.